Eight minutes, that's how long a 38-year-old father of four and men's U of O assistant golf coach lay without a pulse in the middle of the road. Van Williams, seen here with his wife Danny, collapsed while running last weekend in the Santa Clara area. He might not be alive today if not for one man who happened to be in the right place at the right time. Give me five. The games have returned at the Williams household. Down low. Too slow. Aye. Because so has dad, Van Williams. This energy, this compassion. Get over here. Give me a hug. Almost never made it through Thanksgiving weekend. Van went to meet up with his wife, Danny, Sunday for a run on Hunsaker Lane. Danny says her phone started ringing during that run, but it wasn't her husband on the other end. And he tells me that my husband's laying there on the ground. For Danny, the race was on. When I came upon him, his eyes were rolled back in his head and there's no pulse. And I immediately just collapsed to the ground, started praying. It's all I knew to do. But luckily, someone else had other ideas. Benjamin Else, an ER nurse on his way home from the night shift, just happened to be driving by. As another man waved cars around, Else got to work. I was still in the work mode and started uh, compressions. I was really focused on just praying and the thoughts going through my head are, we've got four kids, God, you can't take him. Eight minutes went by, still no pulse. Finally, the ambulance showed up. I really didn't think he was going to come through when I was doing him until the... The medic said, oh, we have a pulse right when they were loading him up at the end in the ambulance. And I was like, oh, maybe. The only thing I remember is Tuesday, um, waking up Tuesday morning in the ICU. For five days, Van lay in a hospital bed. Slowly, his strength returned, and so did his personality. Despite that lengthy stay in the hospital, the couple never lost sight of one thing, their faith. It was never a, why did this happen? Or it was, hey, God, I trust you. You have a perfect plan. <laughs> Thanks for coming over. Yeah. A plan that included some unexpected help. That's why we called him our angel, because he saved his life. I believe that God put him there. Um, and uh, in a way, yes, that's an angel. And a plan that landed Van right back at home. You haven't given me a hug yet. And into the arms of those who love him most. Oh. Oh, and Danny says doctors are calling Van's condition sudden cardiac arrest. His heart skipped a beat. Everything then shut down. He's expected to be okay and slowly get back into his normal life.